Hey everybody, it's uh, November 30th, 2016, and this is daily vlog number 214, and it's Wednesday, so tomorrow I'll be working, filling at work on the afternoon shift, but uh, that's uh, what I'll be doing this week. I have Friday off, and then my regular weekend at work, but today I have uh, five new stories for you. Uh, first one here is man accidentally locked up in Chicago jail for 32 hours while visiting the sun gets six hundred thousand dollar settlement evidently this man was in to visit his son who was in the Cook County Jail in Chicago and uh, officer told him to go down the hall and uh, to the room on the right and when he did he went through the door and the door closed and it locked and it was a room that they used for visitors for uh, maximum security prisoners and this was on a weekend so nobody knew he was in there the only way he got out was he broke the sprinkler head uh, in the room and got out but he was in there for 32 hours with no food water or <coughs> toilet and nobody could hear his uh, pounding on the door but uh, at least uh, he managed to get out and uh, when he broke the sprinkler it set off the alarm and the fire department came and they let him out but uh, if you want to read about this uh, story you can uh, click on the link in the description and uh, next story here is uh, after 11k seized at airport man to get money back plus interest evidently uh, they thought that the man's luggage smelled like marijuana so they seized his money and and his things uh, back in June of 2015 but uh, I don't know I didn't read the entire article but sounds a little crazy uh, next one here, uh, if anybody's ever ate a Big Mac at McDonald's, you may not have known who actually created that sandwich, but uh, his name was Michael James Jimmy Delegati, and he um, recently died. He was 98 years old, so we got that there, and then... Uh, next story here is gang members sentenced for killing man for wearing red evidently this man was wearing a red sneakers and a red shirt and some gang members took offense to that and they killed him now people do stupid things but that is the stupidest thing I've ever heard of and you know evidently this happens all the time because I can remember when I lived in um, Illinois right across the river from St. Louis there was a story where a person at a church was putting up a church sign for an event and a gang member killed him because of the color he used to make the sign crazy some some people ain't got a brain in their head, <laughs> really. That is that is to, to kill somebody because they're wearing a color. Be quiet; they might come looking for you. Yeah, well, they can come looking for me. They're nutty as a fruitcake, and that's just the way it is. I mean, that's the stupidest reason in the world to kill somebody. Yeah, you need a keeper if, if that's your mentality, really. Oh, well, I'm getting on a rant here, so let's move on to the next story. Uh, world's oldest person, Emma Moreno, turns 117. Uh, I don't think I'm going to make it that far. 
when I reach 100, that's it. I quit. Um, don't want to go anymore. I figure that if I haven't done everything I want to do by the time I get to be 100 years old, then it ain't going to happen. So <laughs> that's it. All right, everybody. These are the top stories. And again, if you want to um, um, look at those, just uh, click on the link in the descriptions. And if you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Links down below. And also tell your friends and family about my channel and my videos. And also check out my social media sites, G+, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you missed yesterday's vlog, just click on the image to the left. And please check out my website, the Chuck Baker homepage at chuckbaker.org. The link's up at the top. And until tomorrow, everybody, take care. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, Cindy. Bye-bye, Cindy.